thanks so much for tuning in. So we are on Disney fun fact number eight. Wow. Eight? So we've been doing this for two, four weeks, two a week. Totally cool, right? Yay us. And I really enjoy doing this. I love reading the facts out to you guys. Plus, that means we're four weeks closer to our next Walt Disney World vacation. So anyways, let's dig into Disney fun fact number eight. Going to pull out of the Disney fun facts jar. Now, real quick, if this is the first video of mine that you're clicking on, I have a lot of Disney DIY stuff, and this particular series of videos, I am giving you guys two Disney fun fact videos a week leading up to our trip. So, these are just kind of fun little doodads, little interesting tidbits here and there, going to be super short videos. I draw a fun fact out of the jar, read it off to you guys, chat about for a second or two, and then let you go on your merry little way. So, let's see what fun fact number eight is. Okay. Okay, so this is a Walt Disney quote. He said, we don't actually make films for children. We make films that children can enjoy along with their parents. Walt Disney. So I really love this quote. This says so much about Walt. Now, through all the, you know, my homework, I guess you could say, me digging up all these fun facts for you guys, I you know, rewatched and binge watched all the documentaries on Walt. I went to Half Price Books, got a couple new books about Walt. Um, and he stated over and over and over again how much he loved to take his family to, you know, amusement parks and carnivals and things like that. But in all of them, it was kind of the same scenario. He would sit on a bench and watch his daughter ride their rides. He would watch them, you know, play the games and things like that. And Walt just really, really wanted to reincorporate the parents with the kids. So I think he just had kind of made up his mind he was going to create something where the parents were interacting with the children. There was going to be no more separation of, you know, looking around and all you see on all the benches are the parents looking at the kids, riding the rides and playing the games. So I think this all started kind of with how much he loved to take his own kids to these parks and to these carnivals. So when he created these movies, and especially when he created Disneyland and Disney World, he decided, I'm going to make rides for big kids and little kids. I'm going to make attractions for parents and kids. I'm going to make this a completely, you know, connected type of event. There's going to be no more going somewhere, dropping your kid off, and, you know, see you in an hour. He wanted parents to do things with the kids. And... So we got Disney World, we got Disneyland, and grown-ups all around the world now love it. We personally love it, and we don't have any children. But I think that's just great that Walt really stuck to that idea of this is not going to be like every other park where you see all the parents sitting on the benches watching the kids riding their rides. You're going to be doing these things with your kids. It all comes back to that, you know, family aspect that Walt just really had envisioned for his his movies and his parks and his legacy. So I kind of think that this is a lot about that mindset of Walt and what he was trying to achieve. So I'll read it for you one more time, Walt Disney quote. We don't actually make films for children. We make films that children can enjoy along with their parents. So very cool concept. Love Walt for thinking that, you know, I'm going to do something that little kids can do with their parents. Or in our case, me and my husband, big kids. Big kids can go do. So anyways, this was just another fun fact um, number eight. I hope to see you next week at fun fact number nine. So I hope you guys have a magical day. Keep watching, like, and subscribe below if you are enjoying these fun facts as much as I am. Bye guys. Have a magical day.